Why, hello there. As you start working in the studio, you're going to be working with graphics. And in graphics, you're going to need to import some clips in to the expression unit. This video is going to be going over the settings that you need to put on those videos in order to successfully have them imported into the system. I'm in Premiere Pro. The first thing I want to do is drag my clip over to the sequence. Uh, you will see it's in there. Yes, the mullet is always there. So now that I have that, I'm going to go to sequence and sequence settings. And I want to make sure all my settings are correct before I even start editing. So hopefully you have filmed in 1920 by 1080 at uh, 29.97 or 30 frames per second. Uh, if you haven't, just make those adjustments here. And then everything else looks good. So, la la la, I've edited everything. This looks amazing. I'm going to go and export it. So, I'm title it, whatever. The format, I want to make sure that it is in QuickTime. This is going to make it a .mov file, which is very important. Uh, the expression will not accept a .mp4. And then under the video codec, I just like it to make Apple ProRes 422. It seems to like it better. And then make sure all those are good. And then I'm going to make sure everything's good over here. QuickTime, 1920 by 1080, 29.97 frames per second. Uh, Apple ProRes 422. And then I can just export. So, yay, my video was exported successfully. I'm going to grab that. I'm going to do one of two things. I'm going to either put that on a flash drive and bring it to me, Jace, or I'm going to put it in my Nexus workspace and I'm going to email Jace and be like, hey, it's in this folder. Can you grab it? Either way works. I'm, I'm content with either, just whatever's easiest for you. Look at you, you little smarty fans, knowing all the right settings for your clips to get them imported successfully into the expression. You're so smart. If for some reason you have followed all of these steps and it still is not importing, we'll figure something out. Uh, we'll figure some sort of solution. But I would say the majority of the time, if you have these settings, you are good to go. This has been New Year, New Jace. I'll see you next time.